There's nowhere to beat the quarry, so that's the bank of England. Within about ten minutes of your last purchase, your bill will be ready. I'm one of these people that thinks everything should pay. I think a business has to be. A going concern or it's just not worthwhile. The day of the auction has come. And I don't know what are your feelings today. After spending the best part of our lives in this quarry. And going back uh, for 40 years. And remembering about this quarry. Going full swing. For 3,000 men working here. And hanging like spiders on these rocks. And uh, I don't know, what are your feelings about it today? Well, my, my, my experience of today is I'm very, very down at the bottom. I'm very, very upset of seeing the quarry uh, going into the armor. Uh, to think that I've been coming here for 46 years, day in, day out. And uh, when you come to the age of over 60, uh, something seems to happen to that industry. Well, you've, you've given the, your best part of your life in the, in, in, to the quarry. Where can I go and find it? Three shillings now instead of two. Gone up a shilling. Well, if we get rid of the luck on this day, it should yield about four pallets. And then there's only five days to go, isn't it? So it'll be a pallet a day. Well, we'll get about ten shillings from each pallet. That's two pounds worth of slates, isn't it? That should do it then, shouldn't it? That should carry us through. I am the quarry engineer at present and I've been working here since 1926 and we did all the patterns and all the mouldings for the maintenance of the quarry in this place here. Uh, they used to work very regular, about five men uh, used to get the casting ready every three weeks and get the molten metal in the boxes. We used to get the raw material of course in the big furnace that's at the back of us here and uh, get it ready uh, for the floor. Collection of all lots of non-ferrous materials and small lots, such as lots 201 to 310, providing they are paid for may be removed immediately, including Saturday and Sunday. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I'm selling through without stopping for luncheon. So please patronize the caterer at your convenience. And incidentally, we have a licensed bar, so if you want a drop of the hard stuff, it is available. And it's uh, tragic to see it uh, gone like this. And we hope that uh, somebody will take it over and uh, keep it as a museum piece and leave every machinery and the foundry, the crane and the furnace, everything intact as it should be in its own environment. I worked in this place for 20 years. I've been a member of the County Council and the District Council and the Parish Council for 23 years. Now, this quarry at one time was absolutely self-sufficient. They did everything they needed themselves, even the engines that uh, pulled the trucks around. They made those, you see. A lot of people will be here for scrap, obviously. They're vultures. <laughs> Before 
Namaskar. No questions? Very well. Lot one, sheer legs. How much are these? Are they five pounds worth? The sheer legs, come along, make your bid. Couple, two pounds on bid. Three ten, three, three ten, four pounds, four ten, at five pounds on the front, at five pounds. Any further bidding? Going at five pounds only. And that will be number one. Lot two, trestles and stands, etc. How much are these? A couple again? They come here, they, 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 they take away bits.